John Dewey is an American educator born in 1859 who continues to impact educational thinkers today. Dewey insisted that learning should focus on practical life experiences and social interaction rather than the more traditional instruction and rote learning that was common in 19th and early 20th century schooling. To quote Dewey, education is not an affair of telling and being told, but an active and constructive process. For Dewey, the learner was at the center of the learning process. He reasoned that authentic learning requires learners to be active participants in their own educative process. School, then, should be a place where learners can confront challenges and resolve them. He was really advancing ideas of learning by doing and experimentation, a scientific and reflective approach in the praxis of education. Dewey is particularly known for what's called progressive education. At the time, education was exemplified by teachers lecturing at the front of classrooms and students were passive recipients of knowledge. Instead, progressive education is more of a liberal experience with the student at the center. It asserts a democratic community of learning characterized by activities and group discussions. Additionally, lessons and unit plans for all subjects should involve active discovery as replacement for passive remembering of facts and figures. The so-called learning by doing process also entailed an engaged reflective practice on the experiential learning. For Dewey, we do not learn from experience, we learn from reflecting on experience. A simplistic view of Dewey's progressive education is that it removes teachers from this learner-centered education. But in fact, the role of teachers are vital and more multifaceted in Dewey's view of education. For example, rather than merely lecture and get students to memorize facts, teachers can be vital facilitators of learning by helping students develop skills and processes to solve problems. Instead of passive rote learning using traditional homework for learning math, teachers can guide students towards developing applied math skills. Students can learn addition and subtraction by building with blocks and Lego. The act of counting blocks and measuring bricks is useful for simple applied math. Similarly, advanced math students can learn calculus and algebra as they explore architecture and engineering projects. Calculus would be required to compute the power needed for complex technological systems or determining structural integrity in buildings. I hope you enjoyed this short summary of John Dewey and his progressive education. Thanks for watching.